The Littlest Angel, a Twin Sisters ebook, written by Kathy East Dubowski. The Littlest Angel. It was December 24th. The littlest angel was hanging off a fluffy white snow cloud, peering at the ground below. What in the world is going on down there? she asked. Why, it's Christmas Eve, said her sister Angelina. A time to celebrate, said her sister Fiona. And a time to give presents, said their friend Olivia. What's your Christmas gift to the world this year? Gift? asked the littlest angel. Of course, said her cousin Dawn. All the angels give the world something special for Christmas. My present is the gift of Christmas lights, said Dawn. My present is the gift of Christmas music, said Angelina. I give the world evergreens, said Olivia, mistletoe and Christmas trees. What's Christmas without holiday treats, said Fiona. I always send lots of sweets. I want to give the world something special, too, thought the littlest angel, but she couldn't think of anything to give. I'll just have to go down there and look for ideas. And with that, she somersaulted off her cloud down to earth. But the first thing she saw was a sad-looking boy. His name was Michael. What's wrong? she asked. My best friend is sick for Christmas, said Michael. I wanted to give her something special to make her feel better. But I don't have much money, and I can't think of anything. I'm looking for something special too, cried the littlest angel. Come on, let's look together. Michael and the littlest angel looked everywhere. In one store, everything cost too much. In another store, everything looked like it would break. Another store was too crowded, and the lines went on forever. At last, it was time for Michael to go home, and neither of them had found anything. Sadly, they went back to Michael's house. His friend Sarah waved at them from the house next door. She looks so sad, said Michael. I wish I could give her something that would make her feel better. The littlest angel stared at the beautiful snow that covered the backyards. It reminded her of the fluffy white clouds where she lived. Come on, Michael, she cried. The littlest angel had an idea. She and Michael stood out in the backyard. Fall straight back into the snow, like this, she said. They both did. It felt like falling into a snow cloud. Now, spread your wings, she cried. She and Michael waved their arms and legs back and forth in the snow. Snow angels, the littlest angel shouted with joy. Soon the backyards were covered with snow angels. Merry Christmas, they shouted up to Sarah's window. I'll show you how to make them when you get better, promised Michael. Sarah clapped her hands in delight. Michael! It was Michael's mother. Time to come in. Thanks for everything, said Michael as he ran home. 
it was time for the littlest angel to go home too. Back on her cloud, the littlest angel felt sad. I looked and looked, she told Angelina, but I couldn't find anything special to give the world. Oh, but you did, said Angelina. Look. Down below, across the snow angels that glistened in the moonlight, Michael and Sarah waved goodnight. See those smiles, said Angelina. That's the best Christmas gift in the world. And the littlest angel smiled too.